Hi, my name is Craig with Equilibrium Digital, and in this quick video, I'm just going to go over a few things you could start doing to help bring in more customers to your business. Um, so what it, this is, kind of a brief SEO video, um, just kind of an audit uh, SEO search engine optimization, just to kind of show you a few tips and tricks you could use for digital marketing um, to help increase your business um, with a fully tax deductible, um, you know, improvement that can help your company grow. So without further ado, let's dive right into it. So just right out of the gate, I clicked your uh, your Angie's list page and tried to open your website um, and it, it didn't really want to open. I could see once we finally got there that it was a Squarespace um, build. Um, nothing too crazy about it. It's, it doesn't look bad, but this isn't more of a design. Like I said, this is going to be more about your um, SEO. So if this is the site, then we'll just dive right in. So the first thing we look at is going to be content. You want to have a minimum of 1,500 words, and that's to be completely optimized with Google. Um, now, I use a tool here called SEO Quake, uh, which you can get for free. It's a plugin in the Google Chrome store that shows you everything kind of on the face value of a website. And it's showing me that you have 325 words. So just by adding about 1200 words to this website you would be able to um, increase maybe some of your standing in Google just because it really helps uh, meeting those minimum uh, those minimum requirements so to speak for the Google algorithm but the second thing it does is, is my second point and it's going to be it helps you get more keywords in your website now what a keyword is is it's it's anything in this uh, Google search window right here so, for example, Garage Door Repair Orlando is one keyword. Um, so when I search for this, your number one competitor is this Garage Door's um, Florida URL, but it's actually Pre Precision Garage Door, these guys right here. Um, and we can see their website is very nice, um, professional, clean, probably has 1,500 words, but we want to look more deep on the background of it and see kind of what's going on under the hood so to speak and for that I use a tool called Arifs which you can get it's $250 a month but it shows you everything about the SEO of a website and what I can see here is they're being found for roughly 1.5 thousand keywords and that is a lot so let's go and look at those keywords specifically just to kind of see what they are now I click the top 33 instead of all of them because I don't want to go through 1000 and I won't even go through all 33 I just want to highlight a couple areas on this page so first the keywords themselves so garage door repair Orlando garage door Orlando Orlando garage door garage door Orlando so on and so forth but let's look at the volume 600 350 300 300 200 that's how many times these specific keywords are searched for monthly now if you're in the top position which is the top 10 then you are likely going to get some of those clicks and the reason I say likely is because Google's click rate has really they release their click rates every year and they showed that 80% of people will not scroll past the first page when searching for something on Google. So if you're not on the first page, you're basically in those top 10, then you're probably not going to get clicked on at all. And if your website's not getting viewed, then you're not bringing in the business you could be bringing in. So with that being said, if you look at 6, 350, 300, 300, there's a couple thousand, you know, just right here in the top 20. And if you're missing on those clicks, it's a lot of business that you're missing on. So how do you get to that front page? Well, that's the last thing I want to talk about, and that's off-site SEO. Basically, anything going on to bring your website up. And we usually focus on the backlinks and link juice. So what a backlink is, is it's a website pointing to another website. And there's a transfer of power there. So if site A is pointing to site B, then site B gets some of that power. Now, this is what influences your DR or domain rating. Now, the higher your DR, the higher you're probably going to be in Google. It's basically a popularity contest. Google wants to see more relevant websites pointing at you. But you need to be careful. Don't just go for the most backlinks. You want to make sure they're quality. It's more of a quality and quantity than just a quantity thing. If you have a lot of spammy, bad backlinks, then it'll actually bring your site down because it'll affect your UR, which is kind of like your trustworthiness. Hopefully this all makes sense. But the last thing I want to touch, touch on is all of this combined, what it does for you. We can see that with their backlinks, their keywords, their referring domains, they're drawing in a thousand clicks a month. A thousand clicks. So if you look at that, 10, if they just convert 10% of those, that's a hundred more sales a month you could be getting if you were at the top. Just think about that. So in closing, we discussed three things. We talked about content, having 1,500 words or more on your homepage. We discussed keywords, and I showed you how much search volume there is in your area for those certain things.
Lastly, we talked about how you get to the front page and getting your offsite SEO. Now, in this brief video, I obviously didn't go over everything that's going to get you to the top and stay at the top or else I'd be without a job. So if you want more information and you want to see what else you can do to help your business grow, then you can give me a call at 813-515-3488. Once again, my name's Craig and you can email me back or reach me at 813-515-3488. I look forward to hearing from you. Have a great day.